Back to the poem. Don't hold on to the mead horn, but drink your fair share. Say something useful or stay quiet. And no one else will judge you poorly if you go to sleep early. Makes me think of that old uh, saying that early to bed, early to rise makes men healthy, wealthy, and wise. And I do like that it says, you know, don't hold on to the mead horn, but drink your fair share. And I, I take that to mean is that, you know, enjoy yourself, have a, have a good time. Just don't, don't overdo it. Um, and again, say something useful or stay quiet. Just make sure that you're, that you're precise with your words and that you're not speaking for no reason, just to hear yourself speak. This is another annoying drunk person. This is the one who just, you know, we talked about it earlier. They just don't shut up and you can't get a word in edgewise. So, you know, don't be that person. And then when you're done, you're done. Go home and go to sleep early and get up the next day feeling good. I like all of this. <laughs> no, it's it, it's a it's a great uh, great verse. A call to moderation at the end of the day, but many calls to moderation in here. What I like about this one, a few things actually. So, don't hold on to the horn. Drink your fair share. So, so I take a. I can look at it also from the, from the other side of it. Don't hog it. You know. You know. Don't. Don't. Uh, don't. Uh, if it's if it's you know a shared communal thing you know don't don't take and this can this can apply anywhere actually like don't don't take too much don't take more than what's reasonable right yeah you know maybe you're a bigger person and you need to eat more or drink more or something like that and that's fine whatever but you, you know i i think it, uh, you can think of someone who eats half the pizza that's supposed <laughs> to be for four people or something like that i mean that's that's just not not very very nice but uh so, so there's that one, and then the the other side of it, you know, if you, if you need if you need to leave the party because you're like, no, 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 I'm done, you know, a- actually someone might judge you poorly for that. You know, you might get bad peer pressure here. People, no, 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 stay out, have some more drinks, something like that. And it's like, I, I think here you get you got to stand your ground on that and be like, no, 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 I'm I'm done. Like, I need to I need to go home. I need to go to sleep and. Uh, so, so, I mean, just, just from the practical example that, you, you know, people may actually look like they're judging you poorly, something like that. It's, you know, through peer pressure or whatever, it's, it's just try to avoid that is, is maybe the, the, the message here. Try and avoid people who are going to be like that, who are, who are just going to try and keep you out and doing these, these things. And, you know, you, you know, you got a good group of friends if, they are completely fine with you uh, calling it a night earlier for than sure. them. So. Plus, it, it's hard for them to judge you the next morning when they are hungover and throwing up and really don't want to be alive and you're fine. So yep. just remember that, that. Couldn't agree more. 